many years, many light armoured vehicles which fitted with simply an unprotected 7.62 or 50 cal machine gun. But that made the gun highly vulnerable. So over the last few years, there's a, a trend away from that, which can include remote weapon stations, which enable the gunner to aim and fire the weapon from under armour, or these what we call cupolas. These cupolas have been designed, developed and manufactured in Jordan and have been installed on a number of platforms, tracked and wheeled. Now, commonly known this particular one is Snakehead. And if we see one on the left with a single machine gun, this is the latest one here, the Snakehead Mark VI, and that is armed with two 50 cal machine guns, each of which is fitted with an ammunition box or feed system came containing 200 rounds of ready-use ammunition. As you can see, it's got vision blocks for all-round situation to win in this. And if required, those vision blocks can be fitted with a wire mesh protection. In addition, it can have a, a roof-mounted searchlight for operations at night. And if we look at this one on the right, this is another role for the snakehead. This is armed with a 50 cal machine gun, and it's in a what you call a protected system which would typically use at the main gates of, of military installations, nuclear power stance, um, any high value target which is potentially at a risk. And it provides the gunner with not only observation but also high level protection. And the lower part, which is also of all weather steel, also has some sliding firing ports as well. The basic one was always manually operated but it can be offered with a uh, electric power supply and it normally has fans to draw any fumes away from the turret and the crew. One of the more recent developments is to fit an El Salsan thermal site which enables targets to be located and if confirmed with hostile engaged under almost all weather conditions.